Hey, Internet. This is, uh, this is quite the surprise. It seems something came into the mail today that I was not expecting. <laughs> uh, yeah, pretty weird. It seems that I got perhaps the microphone that I have been yearning for. It said it wouldn't arrive until the 29th, 30th, something. Uh, but here it is. It's here. <laughs> I'm like super surprised. Uh, so I figured, you know, I was just going to go tear into it and set everything up. But it seemed like a good idea to maybe do it on stream and see if OBS is cool with it. Uh, now, there is an exception here. I'm going to need to ask my brother to turn down my own system because I can hear myself through my door. Which is very strange. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had that happen before. But I can hear myself. And it's a little distracting. I think that's better. Alright, thank you. <laughs> We're off to a technically good start. Jesus Christ. Did you even hear that? You probably could. They can hear music out there sometimes. Okay, hang on. Everything's all weird. So I fucked around with everything. Give me a second. AFK is going away. Poof. So everything's going to be off-center, because I'm actually still hooked up with the PS4. So I need to make sure, and I'm big. <laughs> I'm big. I haven't done this since uh, I won that Twitch RPG sweepstakes. Let me make sure everything is in line over here. I mean, hopefully the brother sees it too. Uh, oh, boy. Yeah, okay, it looks fine. All right, it's good. So, I mean, there was an issue last time where the thing went out of sync for some reason. But, any case, uh, so, Blue Yeti. <laughs> I can't believe it showed up today. But here, here it be due. It's right here. I can't believe it. This thing is the Blackout Edition of Blue Yeti. I think it's been around for a while, actually. This is not particularly, like, a new device, I guess. Mm, it's been around. Let's see if I can kind of center that there a little bit better yeah might have been able to do this a little bit better but like i said this is sudden so a little bit yeah whatever uh this was sudden i wasn't expecting this for another three days or something you know uh but it turned out this <laughs> along with my salad spinner showed up in the exact same package today despite ordering both of them on separate days one after the other somehow they merged it for me which is Fantastic. <laughs> now, I've been really excited for this. This is a cool thing. Now, just to kind of give the background here, because I, I kind of want to go over a few things. Uh, when I first started streaming, I got... This This was something that was recommended. A Yeti... Uh, uh, I'm, I'm Yeti. Blue Yeti. Okay, I'm, I'm mixing up terminologies. But uh, this, this is basically kind of not the starter... But this is what a lot of people tend to use when it comes to, like, podcasts and, and stuff like this. You know, talking. It, this is a really professional, high-quality mic. Now, when I started out, which was four years, I think it's almost five years now? Is it five years now? I think it's still four. I think we're still working on four. Uh, when I started out, it was 2013? December 2013? Holy shit, it is five years. Damn. So five years ago, oh my god, I started streaming on the PS4, and I didn't have a microphone, and I simply just used the little shitty mic that I think I threw away. Yeah, I think I put it away somewhere. But it came with its own little microphone. It was an earbud and a mic, and you could use it, plug it into the controller, you're good. Now, that worked on the PS4, but the quality was pretty bad. You can actually hear it on my very first video I have on YouTube, which was... Aliens Isolation? You could see that there. Now, uh, that was not a very good microphone, obviously, because it's just kind of used for whatever the purpose is, right? You just kind of put it in and you're good to go. Now, <laughs> after that, when I actually started streaming a bit, and I kind of did it as, like, just to try it out, right? Well, it ended up being pretty cool. I had a couple of people join me for games, and so, like, the first handful of games, I had, like, 40 or 50 people. Later, I would learn that it was because the PS4 is kind of landlocked on who you could see on the PS4. So, I, that's largely why I had a lot of people. But, 
I kind of felt, okay, maybe people enjoy this, and I'm having a good time. That was really the main thing. Let's take it to the next step, and then in comes this guy here, which I'm not sure if I can do much without breaking everything. But, you know, this is going to be a stream where we break everything. I think that's the deal. So you can kind of see it there. Maybe I can... There you go. <laughs> the blue snowball. This guy is really nice. As you can tell, apparently I'm a fan of black. Mm, probably couldn't have guessed. This blue snowball has been our companion. It has been my voice's window for you guys for the last five years, I guess, now. It's been very close to five years. Um, it was recommended as a alternative to the uh, Yeti. Because the blue Yeti is somewhere around 100 at the time it was 140 bucks. I think it was more like 160 or something. It was very expensive. And I didn't know if I was going to really be into streaming as much as I thought I might be, you know? So I wanted something a little bit more cost effective. Lo and behold, this guy comes by Snowball. It was actually on sale. Normally I think it's like 60 bucks. I got it for like 40 bucks. 20% off. I thought that was pretty good. So I picked it up, and I ended up liking it so much. In addition to using it to stream, I ended up using it for my MMO runs. Uh, I was playing Final Fantasy XIV at the time. So I would use that to talk to my group while we went and did Twintania and shit like that. You know, uh, Coil, whatever it was called. So it was great. It worked really, really well, and I loved it a lot, and I still love it. I think this thing is fantastic. This is the snoo the, 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 the snoo blue ball. <laughs> This is this new blue ball. Uh, this thing goes by. This thing does everything I could ever ask a microphone to do. I mean, it's got really nice quality. Uh, the only th it, it lacks a lot of options. Like, I can't mute it on the device itself. I can't. Um, I really can't do anything. It's, it's just a standalone mic. It's just a mic. It doesn't have all the cool little tweaks and options and shit. Um, but it delivers a really good quality sound. It, it was way better than any headset I've ever used. You know, a headset with a microphone on it. And um, I liked it a lot. So I've used it the last five years. Almost five years now. I can't even believe I'm kind of choking on that one. Five years <laughs> I've been using it. Well, I mean, I, I, maybe it's more like four and a half or something. Because I used that little shitty one for quite some time when I was actually on the PS4. Then I got the Snowball and plugged that into the PS4. And I was able to use that as the mic, which was great. Uh, and then I moved eventually to the laptop and I kept the Snowball, got the camera, you know, and I kind of upped the game a bit from the laptop. Uh, and then from the laptop, we went to PC. And I still have largely everything that I had from that time. The webcam still fantastic. It was the most highly rated one you could get when I started, and I think it's still considered among the best. Uh, it's pretty great. So I got all this really cool stuff lined up. What's up there, Liquid? TMI? Well, that's what this is about. We're, we're talking technical shit. So I like, I like to be as open as I can about my streaming stuff. So I like to explain, because I used to get people that come in here. How is your stream set up? What do you do, you know? And I've got a couple of videos that explain what I've had. It's just, it's been a long time. Because, frankly, I mean, the only thing I ever really did with the stream was get an actual computer that we put together. The stream helped me build it. So, now I'm getting a new microphone and everything. I kind of want to go over the skim here to kind of give people an idea of what things are like. Plus, this is all kind of, like, help to be evidence of what this microphone kind of sounds like. Because, you know, if I'm sitting back here... You're probably picking up some uh, sound from the room that's bouncing off. You know, you can kind of hear that. In any case, like, this no, this thing has been good. But, I mean, I don't have any real complaints. But if there is something I like to complain about, it's basically that it sounds a little tinny, I think. Maybe, I don't know if it's, like, too clear or something. It picks up everything everywhere. And I don't have it on the setting to do that. I have it on just the forward setting, but... You probably heard my brother earlier screaming from the kitchen. And you guys have commented before that you can hear music in the background. I think this thing just picks up stuff like crazy. I'm not like 100% certain. 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 I'm not 100% certain. Uh, 8 out of 10 currently. <laughs> you mean the volume, the sound quality? So like the sound quality, I mean, it's being extremely nitpicky, just to say it. But it does have that kind of a tin sound. And you can hear the reverberation off the walls 
I don't know if that's any fault of the mic, but these are the things I mentioned because I really have a hard time coming up with anything that's wrong with the mic. I mean, it just, it sounds good. It does everything you could. And for 40 bucks, I mean, I didn't think you could get something this nice for 40 bucks. It's incredible. So, um, that's the snoo, the, the snoo blue ball. That's the snoo blue ball. Uh, or rather, maybe the uh, blue snowball, I think is what I'm supposed to say. So that's that. It's a great microphone anybody who's starting out and isn't sure they want to drop the money on this guy is perfect um as a viewer i have no complaints but it does have a lot of high end and not picking up low tones i've that is that is the other thing and that's kind of what i meant by the tinny stuff we can't hear the full effect of your deep manly voice yeah definitely so i that's exactly what i what i think too like uh that's that's kind of been my problem with it is that I, I think when I listen to, to myself in, in my videos and stuff, it does sound tinny. It, so, it sounds high-pitched. You know, tinny, tinny. It's a tinny word, you know. It's <laughs> Caribou gone. But it's a, it sounds like that. It's got that. And I don't know if about the reverberation off the walls. That's probably just my room. But, yeah, it's... It all and when I, when I peek, the other thing is when I when I shout. I don't mean to shout, but I get into my shit. When I peek on my volume, it really pierces in. And then when I'm you know when I'm just kind of muttering to myself back here, you don't really hear it that well. Could be more of a volume thing, you know, because could maybe the game's too loud and I don't have very much volume in my voice, and then I gotta kind of pick it up because I I kind of naturally project. I kind of yell into the mic. That's kind of how I do it. I don't know if I'm supposed to. It's just something that I did that I've always done. Uh, so, I mean, all that stuff kind of goes into the device. Um, and I think maybe the device doesn't handle a lot of those variations well. I mean, those are the only complaints I could come up with. But they are kind of irritating, right? Like, I would like to not have the spikes be so... It kind of... It's not so much that the spikes are, like, high volume. It's just that it sounds like it's all going into one channel. And so it kind of sounds distorted and weird when I hit a high pitch. That adds to the unpleasantness of the experience. So... That's the blue snowball. It's a fantastic mic, and I think anybody who's trying should get it. But this, this is the blue Yeti. The blue Yeti is absolutely a step above in terms of professionalism, if for no other reason but because it has little knobs on it. <laughs> it and I'm looking at the back here. I don't even know if you guys can really see what that shit is. But look at this thing. It's a 12-inch cock of mics. Yeah, it is a powerhouse of a mic. Now, the thing is here, there's a lot of stuff on the back. And I don't really know a lot of it. Um, there's a mute button. Well, my program already mutes for me. So that's cool, but I don't really need it. Uh, mic control, mic gain control. Well, I don't gain a lot, and I don't need control over what exactly I gain. So, I don't know what that means. Mm, four polar panner selector. So now, my blue snowball has four devices, uh, four options on it. Is there a button viewers can mute you? Yes, it's called the mute button. It's on the video. <laughs> you can, yeah. Uh-oh. I think the dog wants up. Well, I think you should stay down there for now. This is going to get messy. I got to unbox this fucking thing. This is really impromptu. I I honestly just got this, sat down, and it was I was going to set the whole thing up, and then I was like, you know, fuck it. Let's do it on stream and see if I can. You know, I don't even know if I can. I don't know if OBS is going to pick up the microphone and all that. You know, it's going to be weird, but we'll, we'll try it. Um, but yeah, so it's got a four-pattern selector. It, it's got uh, stereo cardioid. It's got a shirt. Uh, Omni and bi-directional. It's bi-curiously directional. So, I don't know what any of those are. I only set it up for the... I think I just set it up for the basic. Because the Blue Snowball has three. It's got directional. It's got area effect. So it goes back and forward. And then it also has a musical one. So that you can play music for it. And then that will capture the sound better. Kind of weird. Hmm... I'm excited for this, too. <laughs> you can keep your panties on, though. You don't have to get new ones if you don't want to. Um, yeah, so I'm not really sure which pattern I do. Uh, I think maybe it explains it a little better. Yeah, stereo is vocals, ensemble, and instruments. Oh, okay. So stereo actually goes from the front and to the sides. Cardioid. Cardioid? Cardioid. What the hell is a cardioid? Cardioid. 
is straightforward. So that's what I'm going to be using. It's just going to be a shotgun blast to my mouth. Uh, and then there's the omnidirectional, which is everywhere, and then bidirectional, which is when you're not sure which gender you want to fuck. Uh, you can just put it the bidirectional, and you get the option of whichever one. Mm, sounds good. So, that's that's the Blue Yeti there. Uh, master volume. ASR streams confirmed, yeah. Is it going to be me snorting? <laughs> it's going to be awful. I regret doing that. <laughs> I regret doing that, and I didn't even hear it from your end. Uh, <laughs> master volume, that's a great knob, right? Who, who doesn't like knobs? Zero latency, head foot, head foot output. Head foot output. No, it's a headphone output. That's cool. I actually bought some shitty little ear chromes, right? So I've been looking for a way to do that. Uh, I didn't know I was going to buy this, number one. But... I actually bought it so that I could plug the headphones into my system over here, and it works. It actually works great. I, I, I bought a little extender so I can be nice and far back and not have to worry about it. Uh, but maybe I could just plug it into this, but mm, that's kind of weird, right? Well, what is the output headphone output with amplifier and volume control? What is that, what is that about? Like, is, is that so I can hear myself talk? Because this... It has a headphone jack. Does that mean that the sound will... The, the game sound... Does that... The computer sounds will go through it or something? Like, I don't quite get what that means. But it doesn't really matter. It's a headphone jack. I'll probably fuck around with it at a later point and see exactly what it's about. Uh, USB mini jack. Mini jack USB. I take it that's just what this thing uses to plug in as a USB. Standard thread and mic stand mount, yeah, and then a custom base with cable management. Yeah, okay, whatever. <laughs> it's fucking, it's a blue Yeti, okay? Now, the only thing I know about this uh, is that professionals fucking use it. That's all I know. That's all I really know. The other thing I know is that my dog wants really badly to be up on the couch, apparently, because he just, he is curious. Um, I actually have to thank Rip for this, because Rip... Over at that level up your game. Cool guy. You should check him out. I called him a mid-tier Middle Eastern one time, and he was pretty cool with that. So, you know, that's a really chill guy when you do something like that. When you get the whole guy's entire race wrong, uh, and he's chill about it, that's pretty nice. So, you should definitely hit the guy up. Any case, that guy is definitely a fast-approaching top tier. He had a coupon that let him that lets you get this thing for cheaper... Uh, at some weird place I don't even remember. But he had it over Black Friday and Cyber Monday. So I used that code in addition to going to Amazon, or not Amazon, but uh, the, site, the site he picked up, and they had the Blackout Edition, uh, which I was surprised by because earlier I had checked and I didn't see it, uh, but then I saw it on Amazon for roughly the same price, but now Rip's coupon made it even cheaper. And I was like, wow. That's cool. <laughs> now, I imagine the deal is off at this point because it's uh, not Cyber Monday. It's the day after Cyber Monday being a, a non-Cyber Tuesday, I guess. So probably can't utilize it anymore. But it was a cool sale that was there. It was an extra coupon, and it really made me consider it. And then when I saw the Blackout Edition, I was like, let's go for it. I think in grand total, I mean, it came to like, after everything was said and done, I think it was $90. $92 after everything else. I got free shipping and stuff. So $90 for what is normally a $140 base item. I mean, that's a pretty good sale. Pretty good. And, you know, I mean, <laughs> Rip uses this shit. He doesn't use the Blackout Edition, I don't think. But he, he uses one of these, or at least he used to. Uh, I know Eris uses this, fucking, pretty much everybody in the world uses one of these things, unless they've got, like, a super high quality, I think maybe even Maximilian has used or uses it now, it's like, this is just a really popular professional microphone, I guess, I mean, it seems to be everybody, when I was first starting out, this was the option to be professional, and that's what everybody used, and I was kind of tempted to buy into the hype right away, but, since I was just starting out, I figured, fuck it, We'll just go through the motions and handle it later, right? You know, we'll just get some cheaper stuff. Now, after five years, almost five years of streaming, I think it's about time. 
I mean, I got a bunch of extra money from working all <laughs> way too much overtime. Uh, and, you know, I'm an affiliate. I have been for like a year now. And it's been a wonderful time. I got subscribers. I got Liquid Identity talking shit and trash and all this stuff and chat. Like, I couldn't ask for a better time to upgrade my rig. And here it is. This is it. So, let's go ahead and bust this guy open. Because that's a, basically my entire understanding of this mic. Is that other people who make a lot of money on Twitch use this thing. So, I'm just going to assume it's good. Um... There's really nothing else to it. I mean, I could try and show the box a little bit more, but I mean, it's just... <laughs> I don't even know what a lot of that stuff on the back is there. I mean, it's just kind of weird, right? Mm, they're like Yeti facts, I guess. There's an actual Yeti being shown on it. It's like, whatever. Um, I guess we could break into this. Unfortunately, I got my dog on my feet. <laughs> so this is going to be a little weird. Uh, we might play some For Honor to do my dailies. So that we can test the sound levels together and see what I need to do for that. Mm, I didn't bring any tools. I don't even have any keys. I hope there's nothing I really got to break into here. Mm, what am I going to do here? There we go. So, I mean, I guess I just pop that open like that, right? I guess I can try. I don't know how this works. I've never actually seen this. <laughs> I've never actually seen an unboxing stream, so I don't really know what the what the common nomenclatures are. <laughs> You're gonna make me feel guilty about unsubbing. <laughs> it worked. That's what I was trying to do the whole time. Uh, shush. I'm trying to figure this out. This is a bit of a Pandora's, a really nice smelling Pandora's box. If there's any points to give to the smell, it just got like an eight out of ten really nice not quite a new car smell but pretty good i like it uh considering i can't smell very good anyways my nose is constantly in the state of fuck you so it's kind of hard to smell just about anything mm. Ooh, yeah that's that's new cardboard smell right there that's good all right don't pee on the box <laughs> it will definitely do it so comes in this guy huh it's a condom for the bigger condom it's a big black condom and then you get a medium white condom sounds great that's just to make sure it's protected, I hope. I don't know what else it would be used for. Uh, I don't know why there are holes in the back. Mm, this one seems to have been punctured. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't really get it, but whatever. I guess we don't really need to worry about that. Uh, man, I could have planned this out better. I didn't plan this. That's the problem. I don't even have like my phone on me and shit. I don't got keys. The dog is all running around. He's like, what the fuck is going on? Mm, how does this open up? Now, I'm trying really hard not to... Oh, fuck. <laughs> There's tape on it. <laughs> so this is more like a sign thing then. It's almost... You gotta lay it down like a tomb or something and then open that shit up. Uh, you are getting way too excited, Puppo. Okay, hang on. I got an idea. I got an idea. If I lift you, <laughs> like that, now you're out of the way and you're happy. Okay, perfect. We got him. Uh, plus you guys can enjoy the actual star of the show. Mm, I got some keys or fucking something. I mean, what if I use a cell phone charger? Would that be weird? Cell phone charger. Here we go. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. Oh, that was beautiful. I just stabbed right in that ass. That was easy. Mm. Is it, is it kind of spiking? Oh. Okay. It's, huh. All right. It's like that. Weird. All right. So, this looks like the USB cable. It's actually got a mini USB that goes into the mic. So, it's kind of like the PS4 controller, I guess. Hmm. Okay, cool. I'll just put you there. We have, of course, a pamphlet that says words. Uh, as you know, I'm not a fan of reading. So, look at it. Uh, what else do we got here? We have this weird white block. <laughs> I feel like a cell phone's going to be in here. How do I lift this thing? Maybe, maybe I don't... Ooh... Okay, the whole thing needs to come out. There is a lot of condoms for this thing. I'm quite surprised. Ooh. Oh, okay, okay. I gotta hold the base. Oh, the box is gone. All right, there we go. This is... 
okay, well, <laughs> I guess that's the base. Mm, I'm gonna put this over here with the pamphlet. The box is now discarded. I don't know what the holes were for, but uh, they're not used for our purposes, apparently. Yeah. Put that over there. This is here, and then I guess like an egg, I perhaps can simply... Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> cool. Look at that. I think this is the back end. It's upside down. Oh my god, it's upside down? What the hell? So, it, I thought this was right side up, but if you look at the text, it's upside down. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, so, I think maybe... If we remove this part, get the fuck out of here. What the hell? This is really stuck on here. I don't know why. Okay, there we go. There we go. What kind of marginal. There we are. Perfect. All right. It has now been fully decondomized, and my big, fat, sticky fingers are now all over it. You can't really see it too well, can you? So this, I don't even know what part you guys are looking at right now. It's upside down. You see? It's totally upside down. I don't know what this is. Uh, that's really weird. Wow, look at this base, though. This is heavy, all right? My initial impression is that this, this is heavy. This is a heavy, heavy thing. I i didn't realize it was going to be this heavy. It, it feels like the whole, candy? Oh, no, this is the air sucker things. Don't eat this part. This is, um... Usually you find this in beef jerky. I don't know why it's in here, but that's cool. I mean, I guess. i got to put it away so the dog doesn't think it's food. Mm, yeah, this is heavy. This is a heavy piece of steel. This whole thing feels like metal, you know? This is not an easy piece of equipment. Mm, I, I mean, considering you guys and the snowball, I mean, it's got some heft to it, but not that much. It's actually pretty easy going. This, though? This is not something... I mean, I actually... <laughs> I'm a little uncomfortable grabbing it with one hand because I feel like it's going to fly out of my hand. Looks nice, though. I mean, it's all black. That's why you guys can't even see any detail on the damn thing. <clears throat> Moisture fucks with advanced, sensitive, high-tech equipment. Is it really this high-tech that it can't even stand being constructed and just general weather is going to fucking kill it? <laughs> That's creepy. I didn't know what I got into. I'm a little worried about that. Well, whatever. Fuck it. My room's wet. I'm a sweaty guy, and uh, moisture just comes and goes. So, um... <laughs> it's a switchblade... This is a... Wow. <laughs> this, this is a penis. This is a penis. I mean, look at that thing. That's a penis right there. That is a serious... I'm going to have to speak into this all day. Oh, boy. Hubba, hubba, hubba. Oh, man. How does this work? This is bizarro. Whew. So, it's a collapsible penis, apparently. What's up, Buck Nasty? Have it hanging from the ceiling like a box? Oh, shit. I can have it right outside the camera? In this ring... Buck Nasty is a very horrible horse. Yeah, this is a really cool thing. I, I can grab that shit and be like, fuck you, and then put it right back here. <laughs> That's hard to hold up. Up, up, up. Upside down. Oh my god. If you're not careful, this can slam into the base. You hear that? That's not good. But then again, this wiring stuff is like made out of metal too, so it's like, fuck it. It's not that big a deal. This is... This is really floppy. Like, look how floppy this penis is, man. I really gotta cradle the base and stroke the shaft. Yeah, I mean, I really do have to cradle the base. And then this is all loose. You gotta be careful. Um, it looks like there's little knobs that maybe you could... Oh. Yeah. Okay, there's little knobs that you can give it some rigidity. Make it a little stiff. Just a little stiff. All right, cool. That way it stops flopping everywhere. <laughs> now, is this... Is this straight up? Am I, is it supposed to be pointed at me from like the top or... Uh, I'm not really sure. Hmm. So, uh, right away, 
So there's padding on the bottom. That's nice. There's a little padding stuff. I think that's going to be an anti. Oh yeah, that's a that's a. This is not going anywhere. There. Now I can say right away, I'm a little bit disappointed. I thought this was smaller. I thought this might be a little more compact, but you know what? This is a big microphone, and it is not smaller. It's actually longer. It's thinner, but it's longer. This is a this is a long penis. And this is a ball. So that's going to be a little weird for my setup because I actually try to read chat over the balls. So I can because of that. But this guy is going to be blocking you guys, I think. Let me move this over to here. I'm just going to get rid of this garbage here really quick. Okay, hang on. Hang on. There you go. I still got you. And I'm going to put this right here. Ooh. Well, you know what? I can still read chat. Yeah, I can still read chat. It's not so bad. Um, maybe I can, like, point it. Yeah, if I just point the penis more towards me, then it actually works out really well. Mm, cool. Look at that. Man. <laughs> this is crazy neat. Huh. So, it's got a big blue on the front there. Uh, it's got a mute button. Mm, volume changer. Wow, this is crazy. Mm. Crazy but weird. I guess it's pretty straightforward. There's what is gain? Do you guys know what the gain is? Maybe I have to read what that is on the back. It says gain on the back, but there's a volume on the front, so it can't be volume, right? Mm. Cardoid. That's what I need, right? The cardoid. Hmm. Okay, yeah, carteroid. We want the carteroid setting. So let's go ahead and change that right away. Mm, oh man, this does okay. There we go. This is, moving this nub is very stiff. Wow, super stiff. But I guess that's okay, right? I mean, you don't need to move the pattern much, I imagine. I would imagine. I'm just gonna keep you straight up for the time being for now. Oh, all right. And then I guess the other thing is this. I mean, there are no other components. We now have the whole thing. It's a I like now this is what I like. We have just the power cord and then that's it. It's all very straightforward otherwise. Mm. You know, something I didn't read about. What is the USB port that it wants? Does it want a 3.0 or a 2.0? Uh because I don't have a lot of space for either one. I have been using a 2.0 I think I have a 3.0 though, so I could use that. It actually does not say what it uses. It has to use something pretty strong though, right? Yeah, it doesn't really say what kind of USB port it uses. Let me if I go down in here. This is something that really frustrated me when I was a game tester. Because eventually I moved on to not game testing, but device testing for Microsoft. And they had a million different things. And all of them either required 2.0 or 3.0 USB devices. And you could not plug a 2.0 into a 3.0 without it fucking up. And we had to make note of that stuff. So it was really time consuming testing the same device on different USB ports. And then we didn't always have available USB ports either. Triple capsule array, mm -hmm. multi-pattern. Gain, use this knob to control the gain. Sensitivity of Yeti's microphone elements. Begin recording with the knob centered. If you are experiencing digital distortion with a very loud sound source, simply decrease the gain counterclockwise. If you desire higher sensitivity, Simply increase the gain by turning clockwise. What? <laughs> okay. Mic status light. Ooh, it's actually got a status light on it? Oh, that's where the mute is. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeti includes a headphone jack for monitoring and playback. Use Yeti's headphone output without latency delays. Or use the headphone amplifier to reduce music, movies, or tracks. Hmm. Weird. USB connection. Connects to you with a simple USB. Plug in. 
To perform at its best, Yeti should be plugged directly into a powered USB port, so avoid connecting through hubs or multipliers. It does not speak at all about being a USB 1, 2, or 3. So I think maybe you could just plug it into anything. Nice. Okay. Um, so, interesting. I guess that's all the questions I really had. Let's go ahead and try plugging this guy in, huh? This is a weird stream. <laughs> I don't get to do this very often, but it's kind of nice. I don't really get to buy tech very much, you know? It's like... I, last time was putting the PC together, and I don't know, the time before that I didn't really do this kind of a thing, because I didn't really have a good setup for it, you know? Okay, so we got a really long cable, that's good. I mean, we got we got length, length and girth, we like all those things. Mm, let's grab this over here. So you plug in on the left side. It looks like there's a screw, this is kind of interesting, there's a screw at the bottom of the thing. You know what you were talking about having it upside down? I think you can take this um, penis off. I think you could take the penis off of the base with these screws right here. I think you could unscrew it and the penis detaches from the base. So you can leave the balls wherever you want. But the penis, you can actually screw it into one of those upside down things that we were joking about earlier. That shit was kind of cool. That's That's... Might be something I'd want to do at some point. I was thinking of buying a stand and putting it somewhere so I could have it. Because, you know, I think maybe the microphone now might block you guys. I'm just going to have to play around with it and figure that out. All right, that was easy enough. It just kind of goes in there. Now, it said that it had cable management, but I'm not 100% sure what it... Whoa, whoa, whoa. I meant by that. This thing apparently is... Uh, needs to be a little tighter. There we go. Perfect. So let's grab that there and just slide you back. Now what I'm generally going to try and do here is mimic the wiring of my blue snowball. And that's going to be interesting. Now the, the, the thing that I can try and do, mm, I was thinking I would just replace Maybe I can have both at the same time. That one's going to be kind of strange, but I can try and do that. Let me go ahead and... Hmm, this is going to be kind of tough. All right, I'm just going to leave the camera where it's at, and I'm going to work around the back. I'm going to try and plug this guy in, and we're just going to see what we got. This is a white plug. I'm going to see if I have an extra USB to plug into. And then that way we can juke between the two and kind of do some testing that way. I'm just not 100% sure if I have the available space. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? I think I do. I think I be do. Hmm. Let's try. Now, Internet, I might lose you. This is going to be a tight fit, but I might lose you. Okay, that's not it. All right. Nice. Okay, are you there? Oh, I still got you. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Weird shit all over here. Okay, device is ready. Yeti, Serio, something or other. Okay, hang on. It's doing some shit. I think the uh, Windows 10 is going to be like, what is this trash? Let's see, let's open this up. Setting up a device, Yeti stereo microphone. Yeti stereo microphone is set up and ready to go. Cool, all right. Blue snowball, Yeti stereo microphone. Okay, cool, so uh, let me try. Mm, let me try and do something really quick here. Where's my phone going off? Okay, that's why. <sighs> let's see here, let me fix this really quick. This is some this is some weird shit. <laughs> like I said, I, I didn't plan for this. This shit was way too early. Alright, let's put you like that. Okay, there we go. So I think what I'm gonna do mm, what I wanna do here. 
So I got it plugged in. I see that there's a light on. Now, here's a little bit of a... This, I need to do a little bit of hearing myself, and I know that there's some other ways to do it, but right now I just want to... Uh, I just want to do it through the, the laptop over here. That's how I've always done it. So I'm just going to listen to myself really quick and see. I'm going to take away the pop filter. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take off. So up until now, I've been using this um, device that's supposed to soften the blow of volume that comes through. There we go. This guy. It's a little um, pop filter, I think they call it. It's just some simple thing like that. Mm. They're pretty cheap. Dragon pop filter or something. I'll be using this for this, I think. So I'm going to take it off the Blue Yeti. Or I'm going to take it off the Blue Snowball. Oh man, this thing's dirty. I really should have wiped that down. Okay, so right now we are on the Blue Snowball. And what does that sound like? Right now we are on the Blue Snowball. Okay, it sounds pretty good. I mean, it's close. It's loud. I mean, it's right there. Um, let's see if I can switch over. It looks like it got installed already. So if I just... Grab advanced audio properties. Now the problem is is that the blue okay, I think I got a better idea. 125. Remember 125, because right now that's what my microphone is at. It doesn't have its own volume knob. So I'm gonna switch it down to just a hundred. So now my blue snowball is at a hundred volume. You probably notice that it's quite a bit quieter now. That's because the blue snowball not having its own volume knob. For whatever reason, it just fucking isn't very loud. So in OBS, I need to up the volume quite a bit in order to get over the volume of the game. I've never really been 100% happy with the volume levels of my game in the microphone, so I'm hoping that maybe this Yeti here will kind of give me a little bit more control to make that a little bit better. Most notable is that the two tend to blend together. So that could be a thing with OBS, maybe. And could be one of the reasons why uh, um, 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 split, X split is better. But we'll see. In any case, now that I've done that, split is better. But we'll see. In any case. It doesn't sound too much quieter. You know, it actually sounds okay. It's just when a game is playing, I think you'd, you would notice it the most. Um, so let's put this aside here. Now, I'm pretty sure at this point I should be able to go over to advanced properties. And change the microphone. So edit, no, audio, advanced audio properties? No, it's not going to be that. Let's do file, no. It's not going to be that. No, oh, here we go. Okay, microphone auxiliary properties. Not advanced, but just properties. Microphone blue snowball. I am now switching over to the microphone Yeti stereo. Let's see if it works. All right, so now I am on, I believe, not the blue snowball. In fact, I'm going to be doubly sure by unplugging the snowball. We're going to unplug the snowball from the rear here. All right, I see now that I have activity. And so this should now be going off of the blue Yeti. Wow, that sounds weird. All right, hang on. Let me check that gain. I'm going to put that right in the middle. All right. So, uh, remember earlier it said about the gain. Well, I had the gain all the way to its default position, all the way to the left. Mm, so that would have been uh, counterclockwise all the way down. I now have it right in the center. So, this is the blue Yeti right in the dead center. What do you guys think? Right in the dead center. What do you guys... Whoa. That is... It's loud. <laughs> that sounded really loud. Um, listen. I'm going to fuck around with you guys for a moment, okay? Just check this out. This is the volume knob. No. This is the volume knob for the headphones volume. Ooh, shit. Um, is this... Okay, hang on. <laughs> uh... Is this actually the volume knob? It's really loud. It is really loud. I'm sorry. Uh, give me a second. I'm going to talk as quietly as I can so I don't fuck that up. The volume knob, I thought the volume knob was for this, but it actually says headphone volume. Am I? Did I misread that? Is this not going to change getting started with the Yeti? Uh-huh. Uh, headphone volume control. 
Easily control the volume of the Yeti's headphone output. Oh no, no need to click through softwares to find the right headphone volume. Shit. So, if I... Maybe the gain is the problem, huh? Let me read about the gain really quick here. Mm. Microphone gain. Use this knob to gain sensitivity of Yeti's microphone elements. Begin recording with this knob centered. If you're experiencing digital distortion with a very loud sound source. Digital distortion with a very loud sound source. Yeah, that, 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 it does just sound loud, right? Well, hmm, which way does it want me to go to lessen it? Probably to the left. Mm. Simply decrease the gain counterclockwise. Okay, well, let's go back to that, right? In the center. So I basically did 25% per gen. There we go. Okay, so I basically just did 25 I basically just did 25% on the gain rather than in the middle, I backed it up a bit. So, what does that sound like? Backed it up a bit. So, what does that sound like? That sounds a, a bit easier going, doesn't it? What do you guys think? Uh, that sounds okay over here. But you know, my my you know, my sound volume thing is trash. Maybe I can try um I got this. I mean, it has a headphone thing. Maybe I can do something with that. Mm, monitoring and playback. Use the headphone to monitor your microphone's recording in real time. Okay, well, let's try and listen to that really quick. Mm, let's see here. This is going to be a little awkward, too. Boy, troubleshooting stream stuff is... <laughs> it's kind of fun, but it's also like, oof. I like these headphones, by the way. There's, they're Bose. Bose headphones, real high quality stuff. So, if I plug this in, what do I hear? All right. Now, I have plugged in my microphone and I hear nothing. Now, if I turn up my volume, ooh. Oh, oh, ooh, okay. So, if I just do like this, wow. I can hear myself through the microphone oh my gosh okay um <laughs> what if i mess with the gain a little bit oh, which one's the gain is it the top or the bottom okay it's on the top man you can hear everything you can hear everything i'm doing right now so if i go back like that a little bit ooh, ooh, oh wow that's really loud okay let's back that shit up there and then let's do a little bit like that Wow. So the gain on the back, maybe it's actually best just to have it all the way that way. Wow. Okay. This is... So is it better if I tilt you forward? Do you hear better or worse? I think you hear worse. And if I go like that, if it's straight up and down, I think you hear better if it's straight up and down, right? I think that's the deal here. Man, you can hear. God, you can hear the metal. Oh, that was so fucking weird. When I touch the metal, do you hear that? I hear that. That is crazy. Okay, okay. Let's down that a little bit here. Um, shit. Maybe something like that. You know, the problem is, is that I don't like, I don't like using this microphone. I don't like using this headphone thing because I'm not hearing, I'm not hearing the stream the way you guys are hearing the stream. That's the issue. You guys are hearing it differently than, I'll, than how I'm hearing it. And this is not helping me at all. So I think I have to just keep going to going back to the laptop. So I think I have to just keep going to going back to the laptop. So I think I have to just keep going back to the laptop. Yeah, you know what? That's pretty good there. Let me point this a little bit like that. A little bit off center. What is that like? And then turn that like that. Maybe a little bit louder. Okay, hang on. I'm fucking with shit. Like that. There we go. All right. Okay. I think that's a little bit better. This has been surprisingly easy in terms of just plugging it in and going. I mean, it really works. A little bit better. This has been surprisingly easy in terms of just plugging it in and going. I mean, it really works. Wow. That sounds pretty good. But you know, the problem is, is that my laptop here has bad speakers, so I'm not really sure if it sounds that good. That's kind of the problem. Mm. 
you know, I think what I would like to do, what do I want to do next here? I'm trying to think about this. What is the best way to handle this? Um, now, according to OBS, I am, yeah, according to OBS, it can hear pretty good. What if I'm like, can you hear something pretty good if I'm back here? What, do you, what, do you, what does it sound like if I'm really quiet? You know, if I'm just kind of mumbling to myself. Because it does. I don't even breach into the yellow back here when I talk like this. It's actually staying pretty much right into the green. Just merging a little bit into the yellow there. Staying pretty much right into the green. Just merging a little bit into the yellow. Yeah, that sounds really quiet, huh? Now, if I'm up here talking like this, I think it sounds... It's too low when you sit back. So it's too low. So I do need to up the gain a little bit. I think is maybe... Yeah, let's get you back to that okay so if I do something like that all right so now I'm talking back here I'm talking real quiet but then if I burst open loud I guess that's not too bad I mean it doesn't seem like it's too bad does it loud I guess that's not too bad I mean it doesn't seem like it's too bad does it loud, I guess that's not too bad. Hmm. I'm not actually sure what do you guys think if, if I if I'm kind of talking up here because you know I project I like to kind of yell into the mic a bit even when I'm just talking so if I'm just talking like this this is my normal kind of process here. I'm here, I'm talking some shit, yada yada. Hopefully this isn't too bad. I do peek into the red a little bit when I shout a little too loud. And then if I go back here and I'm just, you know, I'm just talking the way I normally talk, maybe this isn't too bad either. Uh, it could be maybe I'm just too far away from the mic or something like that. It could be that because now if I kind of tune it down a little bit, you know, I'm just like, you know, kind of just muttering to myself, blah, 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 blah. You know, you probably can't hear it too well. It's that sort of thing there. Yeah, that's not too bad, though. Hmm. We might have an okay setting here. Maybe. We might be okay on this one. Um, rather than bumping up the gain, I could just do something else. Let me see here. Let me tighten up the screws again. I gotta make sure this thing is not gonna go flying. Okay, there we go. I'll make sure it's as nice as I can get it. Um, I mean, what if I really shouted to it? Like, can you, what's that like? Because I'm barely getting into the red when I shout. Like, I'm barely there. What's that like? Because I'm barely getting into the red when I... That's actually pretty good. That wasn't too bad. That didn't sound like it spiked that much, did it? Does this have, like, a built-in compressor or something like that? Let me mudge you just a wee bit. Okay, just a wee bit. There. There we go. So, now if I shout really loud, I think it's going to breach into the red a little bit, which is a little upsetting, but... That's kind of the point of this test is to basically break your ears at this point. That's kind of the point of this test is to basically break... That doesn't sound so bad. So now now that I have the gain up, if I chill back here a little bit... Yeah, see, now if I kind of mutter to myself, it's not too bad. Like, I kind of see it's good. it's in the yellow, so you should be picking up pretty good. Mutter to myself, it's not too bad. Like, I kind of see it's, good. it's in the yellow, so you should be picking up pretty... Yeah, that seems all right. And now if I talk at a normal volume, the way that I kind of yell into the mic a bit when I talk, you know, hubbity who. Blah, 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 this is what I do, and then we can see what that's like. Blah, 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 this is what I do, and... You know, that actually sounds okay, but, you know, it's, again, it's hard to tell on, on the laptop. I, I'm going to do something. I'm going to leave you guys alone for a moment. I'm going to kill the mic. Mm, you know what? My camera is not focusing very correctly, is it? Let me do this here really quick. I actually turned off the autofocus. I'm going to turn that back on. You can't see the dog very well, can you? It's not that well focused on him. Hmm. If I turn that off. And then just turn it all the way down. Yeah, okay, that's why that's at. Okay, there we go. Perfect. There we go. That looks okay. The Django LeBur. How's it going? Unboxing channel? Yeah, I've been unboxing it. I this is actually it. This is the Yeti. I got, I, it's playing right now. Here's the thing, though. I can't hear myself. I don't really... I mean, I could hear myself in my microphone if I plug in the earphones and stuff, but I need to hear it the way you guys hear it. I need to stream. I need to know how the stream feels. So right now, it, my microphone is actually bouncing into the yellow right now. It's kind of bouncing pretty heavy into the yellow. I don't... And I don't think I'm shouting into the mic too bad. I usually just turn on... 
I use a Yeti and I don't hear myself. I usually just turn on the stream and audio. Yeah, that's basically it. I'm using over Yeti here. And I don't hear myself. I usually just turn on the stream and audio. Yeah, that's basically it. I'm... You can actually, it's kind of funny. You can hear the difference of when I'm up, up on here, right? When I'm just kind of yelling at the mic. And then if I just pull back, you can actually hear kind of the hollowing effect, you know? It's kind of, it's kind of cool. But is it too loud? That's the question. I think it's okay. It's kind of cool, but is it too loud? That's the question. I think it's okay. Yeah, I think it works out okay, actually. There's a difference. It's nice. I don't think it's ever too loud. Okay, cool. Uh, so let's go ahead and keep it at this pace. I think we got a good balance. Um, let me jump over here. We're going to go do... Uh, we're going to load up For Honor. And now, I have my stereo system muted at the moment because I don't know how well this thing is going to avoid picking up the sounds, you know? Um... Now that we're all done, I showed you the whole thing. I don't need this big ass camera anymore, right? I don't. I don't need it. Uh, let me reset it. Let me grab you. Uh, transform, paste, transform. There we go. Okay, I'll be back to my tiny self. There you go. Uh, but I'll call your mic shit for the time being. Yeah. Okay. Feel that way. That's fine. <laughs> talking shit, huh? Uh. All right, so hopefully you guys are hearing this. I'm not hearing this through my microphone. You guys, I have it muted uh, because I have my thing set up the way I always want it to be set up. Hopefully you guys are hearing everything okay. Uh, and so we're just going to let this cutscene play out. Everything okay. Uh, and so we're just going to let this cutscene play out. Everything okay. Uh, and so... yeah. yeah, maybe it is a little loud. I'm not sure. It could be that maybe my game is quiet. Maybe I could turn on the game volume or something. I'm not sure. You know, this is actually... The, the the movie part doesn't play much sound. It does at the start, but I think we should actually do in-game noises. The problem is, is this game can be kind of quiet, so I'm not sure. Your sub ran out? Don't fucking worry about the sub, man. <laughs> Don't worry about that shit. Don't worry. Like, that's fucking... That's nothing. Don't you worry about that. Chowder will be here. You can worry about the dog face some other time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go get your scream going. What are you playing today, man? Hopefully it's some more Tekken. You seem to be really drowning out into that shit. You're doing really good. I went and played Tula a couple of days ago, and uh, I beat him a few times. I'm actually really proud of myself on that. <laughs> I'm proud that I managed to do that. Mm, this is quite interesting. I think maybe we're looking pretty good. Now, what do you guys think so far about the sound here? Sounds like I'm a lot louder than the game. You know, that's kind of the problem. Execute three and complete two. Okay, let's do a... We're going to do a practice run of Dominion because this should produce the most sound. That will do. And I'll go play my Shaolin Monk because he's been fun. There we go. Let's grab him. Tekken's still likely. Might do Hollow Knight after a while. Cool. Being louder is good on multiplayer games. Uh, really, it's just, I like to have a balance, though. You know, I like to have a balance of the game and of this. And I don't like to fuck with it. I like to have a universal balance. So now, there should be some sound going through. There should be quite a bit of game and a, quite a bit of me. Yeah, actually, that sounds pretty good. I'm not sure of the balance equation. I'll have to do some fine tweaking when I'm done with the stream here. I'm just doing like a quick... I mean, it, it, I don't think it's quick exactly, but I'm just doing this really fast. Um, this isn't fast at all. <laughs> I'm definitely going to have to uh, fuck around on my own and figure out what's going on here. I don't know. I prefer hearing the streamer over the game in case I'm missing the music playing my own game, but you're the leader. Ah, okay, okay. I, that's actually an interesting point. I haven't really considered that before. Uh, let's go where the loudest is. What do you guys think? Now, my game is still muted. I want to keep that in mind for you guys. My game is still you muted. Lost so so I don't know how well things will go once um, you know, that picks up. Uh, we're just going to bop some dudes. There we go. And now we're going to see if I can... Uh... Oh, I'm orange. Oh, shit. I'm supposed to be bopping the, the blue guys. Bop the blue guys. There we go. Perfect. Where's a blue guy bomb? Like, I guess it doesn't matter, huh? Alright, how did that sound? Where's a blue guy bomb? Like, I guess it doesn't matter, huh? Actually, that sounds okay. Why not plug in some headphones to the console? 
Um, because again, I want the whole, I really, I want the whole audio experience for, oh, uh, I want the whole experience, and I feel like if I just do one thing, I'm not going to get what it sounds like for you guys. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Fuck. Damn it. I'm not paying attention. Well, that should have been so sad. Actually, that sounds like it could be really well balanced. What do you think? It sounds like you guys can hear the swings of the weapons and everything. Um, but it's not drowning out my voice. I actually might be... We might have been able to balance this pretty good. Now, I need to kind of do it back here where I'm muttering a little bit. Like, if I'm just kind of relaxing and I'm not really saying a whole lot, like, this is probably when it could get a little bit tough, right? Like, I don't want to... I don't want to have everything all fucked up. There we go. Oh, shit. I gotta take on this guy. This guy's got armor! Oh, boy. There we go. Booyah. Oh, 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 what the hell? Throw? Oh, man, he's trying to ring me out. Oh, boy. Okay, hang on, hang on. Oh, I got him! Bam! Let's get in with the monkey. Okay, cool. So, this is pretty good. If I just kind of calm down that... You know, it sounds like if I'm really quiet... Oh, shit. It sounds like if I'm really quiet, I have a hard time uh, hearing it. That's what I was doing to you, buddy. Ugh. Come on. Oh, this guy this guy is a big robot. Yeah, this guy's a big robot. He's level two. Level two robots just completely kill you. Yeah, this guy's a big robot. You lost zone C. That actually doesn't sound like right. I would say lower, yeah, for when you're relaxing. You're otherwise in an optimal zone. Yeah, so the game's a little loud when I'm relaxing, but otherwise it's good. Okay. Because if I'm sitting back and I'm not really saying a whole lot, then yeah. But, you know, most of the time, I, I think if I'm like this, I'm probably not in the middle of something hectic. <laughs> so it's not really going to be that loud. Two of these guys on him. Oh, shit. Okay, he just died. You capture zone C. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. It doesn't sound too bad. I could just turn down the game volume too, you know, because I actually do have it louder than usual because of Red Dead. Red Dead has a very quiet game going. Oh wow, this guy's just running, huh? Alright, let's just jump him. If I run too, I can just jump him. Oh, what? I was swinging! Oh, damn it. <laughs> That's the cool thing about uh, the monk, the Shaolin. You can fucking. Double tap like crazy. That's his. That's his stick. Oh! Double tap. And then let's do one of my favorites. Bam! 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 This is the first time I actually played the Shaolin on stream, so it's kind of cool. <laughs> yeah, it actually sounds kind of okay. I would say yeah when you're relaxing. Yeah, I think it works out okay. That's not too bad. I might. I might need to fine-tune it for when I am relaxing, and that might just be a matter of turning down the game volume a little bit. The other thing is that I'm going to need to do it for PC, too. I forgot about that. I'm going to have to change the settings for PC, because this is just for... This is just the sound setting for, you know, PS4. I'm not really sure. I'm going to have to think about that one. I'm sure we can come up with it. Shouldn't be too bad. Clearing out these dudes. <laughs> it's kind of weird. The Shaolin Monk seems really good at clearing out dudes if you start with the heavy and then rotate between the light and heavy. It seems like it's more effective than uh, the Warden, who is supposed to be doing that. He's supposed to be really good at that shit. Oh, wow, we got some bad guys. Lost okay. Dang, there we go. And then take him out. And then let's do... Whoop, whoop, whoop. What happened? Oh, shit. I got... I got juice. There we go. And then do this. Bam! <laughs> I really like the juice in this game. Yeah, I might just need to turn the game down a little bit. That might be the real deal here. Look how well the Shaolin just kind of cleaves through everything. Oh my god. This fucking... This guy's actually running. <laughs> Get back here, you. Damn. 
and then there, and then let's do this one. Yeah, this is my favorite executable challenge. This is the best. Damn, I like that one a lot. Yeah, it could be I need to turn down the game. I think maybe I'll just turn down the game and we should be good. Um, got a foot to catch from online nerds. All right, cool. Good luck, man. Definitely enjoy yourself some of that Tekken. Tekken. That shit's fun. Bonk him. Ooh, I bonked him. But then I didn't execute shit. I didn't think I was going to bonk him. You captured zone A. Bang, bang, bang. This one's cool. Ooh, <laughs> that looks really good. I like that a lot. Yeah, okay. Uh, are we winning? Yeah, we're winning. We're looking good. Damn, look at all these blue guys back here. They clear the field. Look how well the Shaolin clears the field. It's crazy, right? Shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. And then you can also do the area effect. Oh, what's up? Damn, he running? Where are you running to? Enemy rally. Damn, we're almost winning this, but not quite. Back here. This guy's juking me. You see this shit? Damn. Bonk. Oh, wow. All right. There we go. Damn. What the hell was that? Oh, I hit him, but I didn't get the execute because he had a bomb. That's fucked up. Lost zone a. Clear the way. The blue is starting to win now. Clear the way. There we go. He's perfect. My team is breaking now. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I got him. Damn. And then... Oh, power chop? It didn't work. All right, let's do it like this. No. Okay, let's do it like this. What? And plow. There we go. Back it up. He's going to run. It's okay, because I got him. What the hell was that? I think he nicked me. I think he nicked me from the side. I can't believe we're losing this. How are we losing this? All right, whatever. <laughs> Man, this is kind of weird. I'm not really sure what to make. It sounds like the sound is not very well balanced. But I think that's... Could be, maybe just the game is too loud or something. Game could be too loud. I mean, it looks like in my microphone here you could hear stuff all right. Damn, why didn't he raise him? That was weird. Oh, I guess because the bad guy's over there. There you go. Nice. He just splashed my guy. You know what? This guy's dead now. He splashed my guy. Now I'm gonna clobber his head. Chop the head. Alright, we're both in the danger zone right now. Bonk him. Oh man, this guy's too good. He's a level two. Yeah, he's a level two. Yeah. Take the guaranteed damage. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. This is not good. Oh, man. He got me. I'm sorry. The fucking robots are working together. Yeah, maybe I should just turn down the game volume. I'll have to check the archives or something. I'm sure I could tweak it. Damn, we actually lost? Well, you know, there was a couple of level 2 bots. Level 2 bots basically read your inputs. <laughs> the nice thing, though, is that to get what objectives you're after, you never have to win. You can be you can be paired up with anything. The only thing you kind of have to do sometimes is actually get enough points, which can be kind of hard. If you're up against level 2 bots, uh, you can have a hard time getting your points that you need in order to get your daily done. But, by doing that, yeah look at that, we got all the executes and I just have to do one more round and I could do that uh, dueling or something like that. Which, um, 
Maybe we'll do here. Uh, let me think here. Let me think. What do you guys think about the volume here? Maybe we'll do here. Uh, let me think here. Let me think. What do you guys think? I mean, it sounds like maybe it's just the game is a little loud. And so what I can do is turn that down a bit. So that when I'm kind of chilling back and talking, uh, it's not so bad. Because right now it's at 55. Let's just do 50. Normally I have it at 45. But let's try. Let's do 50 and then we're going to do a duel. Uh, against the AI. There we go. Since I'm just getting grind, I mean, this is my dailies. This is what I do off stream. I just kind of grind for it. But if I turn down the game a little bit, we'll see. Um, I don't need to do a different guy yet. I just need to. I think I just need to do two matches. Sometimes you have to use, you have to win a round, or you have to play a match with two different guys. But I don't think I need that here. Pretty sure I'm just doing a normal. It actually sounds like you can hear me a little better now, so maybe lowering it to 50 is a, it's a good time. Because right like now the music is kind of loud, and then there's that big shout that happens right here, and that, that's kind of loud. Round one. Right Alright, so now the big problem is, if I turn on my... If I turn on my stereo... Now I have my stereo on. Do you think you guys are going to hear anything? Because it's pretty loud. Whoa, it's actually really loud. Do I need to... Uh, yeah, okay, it's on 16. Okay. So let's see if this microphone picks up my stereo system. And if you guys are hearing anything different right now. Damn. Damn. That's too loud. There we go. Yeah, hopefully that's not too loud or weird. Victory! Yeah, I guess we're okay. It doesn't sound like you guys are hearing it too weirdly, right? Probably You're not hearing too. my sound system. That's one of the things I was hoping that this microphone would do. You would not hear my video game uh, over the other sounds. I don't think that's guaranteed. There's a built-in parry if you can time it right. But you have to time it right. Oh. <laughs> it's kind of funny that you can just kind of do that. The, the computer doesn't know what to do when you hit him with the, the unlock. It's just kind of like, yeah. Victory! That seemed pretty normal. Cool. So it doesn't sound like you guys are hearing any feedback from my stereo system. That's good. I like that a lot. Because this is about the level that I typically have it at. Ah, I'm trying to do the, the light parry. There it is. <laughs> So if you do a light attack out of any of the stance, there it is. <laughs> yeah, if you do a light attack out of any of the stances, you're looking good. You get a parry, but you have to do you have to release. It's kind of weird because you're actually holding the button and then releasing it. So it's a little complicated. In addition to that, you have to push the direction of your guard. It only lasts two seconds. So the Shaolin is really tough. It's a high, uh, it's like a high skill character or something. I don't know what they call it. You know, high skill, whatever, advanced skill. In any case, we did some good work there. I think we got... Wow, Red Dead installed something? Strange. So, the big thing really is that Red Dead is usually really quiet. So, let's go do a quick test on Red Dead before I wrap this up. I'm going to do some off-site testing. I just wanted to kind of start things off and uh, unbox the thing. Kind of, you know, walk with you guys through this. Now, I now do have a giant penis that's in my way. And that is a little weird. Mm, I also need to put this on it somehow, which is also going to be a bit of a trick. Uh, but I'm sure we could figure out something here. If I just kind of go like this, I bet I could put it on the table itself. We'd probably be good to go. There we go. I mean, I don't think it's going to really do that much, but I could. Oops. Mm, 
the shit. Hmm. Maybe something like that. That work? No? Okay. Weird. Actually, I might be having some trouble here because it can't go up very high. Uh, so, I don't think you're going to hear it. The problem is, is this game is notoriously quiet. So, I'm not sure what we're going to do in terms of kind of testing Red Dead. Mm, I don't really have a good anchor point for this. Now that I think about this, it's going to be kind of tough. Mm, the thing is, is this does not widen up enough. I can't pull the string back. Unless I can... I don't want to pull this off, it's the thing. Yeah, that's why it's doing that. Okay. I need a, um, I need a better base or something. I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do this. And this one might, I might have to do this later. You know, I don't even know if a pop filter is really necessary for this. Does it even help out at all? I'm, I'm not sure. It might help a little, but so far it's not really anything. How can I get you to expand? There we go. There we go. Whew. Okay. There's a bolt in the way. That's what the problem is there. There's a bolt in the way. But that's okay. I got it fixed. There we go. Mm -hmm. Sorry. I, got, I guess I'm too entranced into this. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay, there we go. I got it on the table. I should be able to... No? Okay, hang on. I think the problem is, is there's a, there's a bolt in the way of where I'm going, so it's causing a lot of issue. Is an alligator going to kill me if I sit here? You guys have any idea? Probably. There we are. Let's put you like that. And that way. This is a really cheap thing. So if I can't get it to work, that's just kind of how it be do not too big a deal. It's just, I think I can get it to work. I just need to figure out how. There we go. Okay. Let's do it like that. There we are. I just unplugged. <laughs> I just unplugged my guy. Fuck. Ugh. Doesn't really want to get on the table very well. There we go. There we go. Nice and tight. Right on the table. Oh, that's much better. Okay, cool. Yeesh. Alright. And then I can just raise you. Kind of like that. Somehow you up. There we go. Hmm. Hang on a second. Maybe I gotta spin you, huh? There we go. That way you could be a little bit tighter. Uh, but then you flop down if I do that. What if I do something like that? Ha ha! Mm. Or... Maybe not, haha. -ha. Damn, this is really finicky. Hmm. Man. He 
These things are hard to work with. <laughs> All right, well, I'm going to have to figure that one out later. It's too rough. All right, so Red Dead. This one's going to be kind of hard uh, because it's kind of a quiet game in general. All right, what do you think? If I'm kind of talking over here and I'm quite quiet, the gunshot actually sounds kind of loud. What do you think? That doesn't seem too bad. I think maybe... Hmm, I think I'd actually be willing to up the volume a little bit. What do you think? Let's up the volume of my game just a wee bit. Hmm over here there we go cool all right so as long as i don't breach into the red that's what i'm really hoping for i don't want to breach into the red at all but now that i've done that now i could kind of make some sounds again right that's why i was up i mean this is really the loudest sound this fucking game makes otherwise it's really fucking quiet like this game is just super quiet otherwise otherwise it's really fucking this game is just super quiet otherwise. Yeah, it doesn't sound too bad. It'd be nice if I had more of a continuous sound, you know? Because if I don't really talk that loud over here, I think maybe it gets turned out a little bit. Really talk that loud over here, I think maybe it gets turned out a little bit. You know, it doesn't sound like it's drowning out at all in there. That's kind of interesting. Now, what about... I'm going to try and do a test here. Um, sound system. I'm muting the sound, and we're going to do a shot. Now I'm going to unmute the sound, and we're going to do a shot. So, did that sound different? I'm going to do a shot. So, I, the thing that I'm trying to stop... So, here's a good one. If I can find someone to talk to, dialogue tends to feed into the snowball a lot. So, we're going to see if... Someone I can speak with here. Lenny won't talk to me. <laughs> Lenny won't talk to me. Uh, what's this going here? Where are you? Somebody in here won't talk. Yeah, a little bit of dialogue there. This guy, he won't shut up. Reverend, you ain't wow. Out of it again, are you? I resent the accusation, Mr. Morgan. We're just making sure you're all right. Certainly. How was that? We're just making sure you're all right. Certainly. How was that? Yeah, see, you can hear an echoing. I hate this. I don't know how to solve that. Um, you can hear an echo in my in my system here. And I don't know if there's anything I can do about that. I mean, I really don't think there's much I can do about it. I'll try and tune it down a little bit. But honestly, it's just one of those things. Like, dialogue in games tends to pick up on my mic. I don't know what to do about it. It's just always been that kind of way. Snowball does the same thing. Hi, Pearson. Good morning. Don't you ever get fed up with all this? Sometimes, I suppose. Sometimes, I suppose. Yeah, it just sounds kind of like an echo. It wouldn't be so bad if I could time the... Um sound together if i could time the milliseconds together i think they would be masking one another but the problem with the the ps4 is that it's not really possible Happy to do to that, that it's never just again. i don't know you're always I just going to kind of hear that that party yeah weird yeah, I'm going to have to do some fine-tuning. I'll see if I can figure that out. It's sort of just whatever. Actually, can I do with this question mark? I bet this is going to be some dialogue, huh? Hey, Arthur. You want to talk? Oh, yeah, that's a lot of dialogue here. Okay, here we go. So, how would I want to do this? Maybe I could just turn this down a little. I mean, that's not a good idea for me, though, because I can't hear anything other than the you dialogue. Okay, Arthur? Sure. You don't look okay. Uh, I'm fine. Sure. What you been doing? Hmm. Acting like a fool. How so? <sighs> Hurting and robbing folks I didn't need to. My, you have been busy. 
Well, that's one way of looking at it. Yeah, I'm not sure how to do this man, one. Arthur. I mean, it's it's definitely Under the microphone me. gain is picking that up. Maybe I can just pull it back a little bit. Mind, there we go. Let's pull it back. I don't feel in control. Just stay calm and do what you do best. It seems I'm best in mayhem. Sure, I'm no better than Micah. It yes, actually seems are. better, although now I'm Still not really in that do. sweet spot that I was before. Stop getting into trouble. But I guess I could just let that rock. <sighs> we'll see. Maybe I could tune it up a wee bit more, just a little bit. There we go. Like, because now, yeah. Hmm. That was pretty good, actually. That was a good attempt there. Actually, that was a really good test. Uh, I don't want to save, because I want to come back and see if I can talk to her again next time. Uh, but I'm, you know, I gotta go eat and do some other shit, so we're, we're just gonna take care of that later. Anyways, here we go! Blue Snowball. Um, I still don't have my... I had this guy here that I was supposed to try and fix, but now I'm not so sure I'm gonna be able to. I mean, it is definitely not happy with itself at the moment. Yeah, well, if I do something weird like that, would that work out? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. It's cool with that. Yeah. I mean, it, it's a little weird, but I could do that. Sure. I'll just kind of get it to be a little bit more... Yeah. All right. Well, it stands out a lot more than I want it to, though. Hmm. Yeah, and it's blocking chat. That's a real big problem. Hmm. Damn. Yeah, I'm going to have to come up with a different invention for this one, I think. It is not too happy with me. This one is not pleased. Hmm. <laughs> I'm getting really fidgety. Okay, listen. Let's let's wrap it up, okay? Now, this is the Blue Yeti. I think we did a nice, long kind of testing spree. You guys got to see all sorts of different shit. I still need to test on PC, which I'm not even going to be able to do while the stream is running anyway. So... I think we got a really good test run here. This is now the blue snowball. What I was using, this is now the blue Yeti. What does this mute button do? If I press it again, wow, it works right away. That's really cool. Okay, so I'll go play around and uh, we'll just see what things are like. Um, and I'm just going to fine tune it. It's It really is a boring process of just really minute changes to get everything just right, you know. Uh, but it's fun. <laughs> so if I don't see you guys today, it's probably because I got absorbed in fixing this stuff and uh, seeing if I could get it to work better. Other than that, I will try and catch you guys later with some Red Dead. Um, yeah. Enjoy some lunch. I want to go get some food, too. Peace out. Thanks for joining me. I'm really excited about this. I'm really liking this Yeti so far. I'm very, very excited. <laughs>